we had a bad memory. That's oh, why I think it's so hard. hard. There's so many. <laughs> I think the, the memory that I'm going to pick is the one that made me laugh. Almost waking to that Japanese man home. <laughs> Come on. I think finding out that I was pregnant with Jackson. That was like surreal. Seriously, I was like, hey! It really does happen, egg and sperm. I'm like, wow, cool. <laughs> okay, sure. I don't know. It's hard because our conversation that we have almost every day, drinking tea, um, getting lost. Um, okay, maybe, okay, maybe that long trip to New Jersey that took two or three hours to see that house and getting lost in the cornfield and then taking some strange <laughs> ride from a stranger and wondering if we were going to get killed. Oh. Because I was with you, we was fun, and we survived. Yeah. Oh, okay. Are there times in being that that affects our relationship? Yes. Oh, bring it on. Do tell, do tell, do tell. You already know this, but I feel yeah. like I can't really go out as much as I want to because we're around people who don't sign, and then either I have to interpret or I feel like you're left out, and I don't like that. Um, I think we're, we're less social because of that, partly. Really? A little bit, yeah. Can we change that? I hope so. I mean, I'm, it's not a huge deal, but... But that bothers me a little bit because if you want to be out more, I don't want my death to stop. It's not really out like going dancing. It's more like, you know, the group where I go mm -hmm. with the Russians, I like... I like that. I would love to bring you more. And I feel like it's, it, it's both. When we're there, people don't come up to us because we're signing and we're not welcoming. They, they can't just come and be like, so what are you guys talking about? You know, they can't. And so it becomes like our own little bubble. That and also um, me having to wake up when the baby cries because you can't hear it. Oh, that's on you, honey. Too bad. Oh, yeah, that's on you, honey. That's on you because I had the nurse all on night. me. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna take the second one to her, but the <laughs> first one. But seriously, the first one, I never really thought of it that way. Where you feel like people kind of rebel from us because of the signing. Well, because they don't know how to behave. This one, this one. I'm just saying, as a deaf person, I never stop to think that I'm like a bug repellent, okay? No. <laughs> no, 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 but it's the fact. It's the fact. And I'm like, because the last time we went to the Russian group, remember? I said it was at the bar? Yes. And I sat there and there was some capturing on the TV. I was walking and you were out but that's that's not, that's not what I want. I, I don't but want, I'm not going to go with you and then have you sit separately while I'm like chatting, looking at you and people are asking, oh, what's she doing there by herself? But I didn't mind I understand, that. but it's just not, it's not, not it's not comfortable. We had this discussion, so now do you think you just go ahead? If there's more events coming up, can you just go? I'm going to try. That's why I told you I was going to go tonight. But my only problem is you wait until the last minute to tell me okay. that's an issue, but you know, I don't want my death and doing anything about me to stop you from being the person you're supposed to be. When was the last time you wished you could hear? Maybe five minutes after arriving here, there's so much talking going on, I didn't understand what's going on, I gotta live with everybody. Yeah, but that's something that happens to you. Then very often, I wish I could hear again. If I had never had any hearing, maybe I wouldn't care so much. But I already have this experience. But I'm already frustrated when I know that I can't be as active as I was before. That makes it difficult. It gets slammed in my face each time someone comes and says to me, I can't look at them, I don't understand what they're saying. I'm like, because mm. I feel less than. I don't have that ability to have a full conversation. I then have to work football as hard just to match them. Yeah. Do you wonder what Jackson sounds like? <laughs> oh yeah, that's why I'm always tapping. What did he say? What did he say? Mm. It's painful. That's why you want him to sign more. But still, he's still here and he still talks. It doesn't matter. It's not about that. I mean, the pain, you can't take that away. You were telling me, I think, I mean, last year in the back of the car, he was singing. I'm looking like, what he's singing? I mean, you can't give that back to me. Doesn't matter if he signs. He be singing. I'm like, he imitates me so much. I'm not even aware of it. 
<laughs> okay. Um, it sucks. That's what I like to say. It sucks. So do you feel like that moment you wish you could hear? Mm-hmm. Who sacrificed this more in our relationship and how do you feel about that? You. What do you mean? You sacrificed more. Uh, now I'm curious. What do you mean by that? You sacrificed your sanity <laughs> for my habits, my cleaning habits, my... Um, I don't know. I just feel like I don't really sacrifice anything, so therefore you sacrifice more. Can I tell you I disagree with you? Really? Mm-hmm. Why? I don't think one of us sacrifice more, but when I look at you, okay, your family and your background and not exactly jumping up and down, woo-hoo, about you being with a woman, okay? What, oh, okay. What about your family? They're really discreetly because I'm deaf, so I mean... You think so? Okay. But remember, you were hanging out with your Christian aunt a lot more before you met me. Okay, I'm pretty sure I really don't give a flying fuck, okay? <laughs> Excuse my name. I really don't. Sorry, forget my name. In our relationship, I saw how difficult it was with you and your mom. Okay. I'm sorry to bring this up again, but for the wedding, alright? Your mom showed up late. She's supposed to walk you down the aisle. It's that a lot. Your mom is still struggling. So I feel like daughter to mom, that relationship is so important and you guys were going back and forth. And I know there were times that you were crying, you were upset, and then don't forget your dad, <coughs> don't forget all of that. And don't forget Carlos too. When we got together, your friendship kind of dissolved too. I just feel like how we deal with life is a little bit different. So for me, I felt like, hey, maybe with the radio disadvantage, maybe I felt like, so I'm black, I'm deaf, I'm a female, so what? Okay, I'm already down, so what? But for you, it feel like, I don't want to say you had to come down. You didn't, but you had a lot more obstacles being with me than I did with you.